What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to this episode of Restorations with Vic. For today's episode, we're gonna be taking care of these Air Jordan 1 Laneys that are super cooked. As you can see, these shoes need a lot of work. We're gonna be using Rejuvenator Street Brush Advancing Alarm System and our detergent to get this shoe looking right. After that, we're gonna repaint the leather and re-dye the suede. We got a lot of work, so let's get started. The first thing we're gonna do is put this shoe to the side for before and after purposes. Next, we're gonna remove our shoelaces and insoles so we can clean those thoroughly separately. All done with that, now let's grab our shoe tree and adjust it to the size and insert it inside the shoe. Next, we're gonna grab our four ounce bottle of solution and squirt two squirts inside our bowl. Two squirts is all you need. Now let's go ahead and grab our soft bristle brush, you guys, so we can start hammering the uppers with the soft bristle brush. Uppers are looking good. The suede on the shoe was super toasted. It's starting to come back to life. So that right there gives me confidence that the shoe's gonna look great at the end of this cleaning. Now moving on, we gotta clean up the insides with a soft bristle brush still. Insides look great. Now let's move on to our next brush so we can take care of the leather on this shoe. All right, you guys, uppers are fully pre-treated. Before we can put the shoe in the washing machine, we're gonna move on to our last brush to take care of the soles on this shoe using the stiff bristle. guys looking good last thing we got to do is grab our insole and laces and give them a quick cleaning for the laces we're gonna put them inside our bowl with the leftover solution and for the insole we'll scrub it down using the soft bristle brush that. Let's grab our sneaker laundry bag, grab our shoe, grab our lace, our insole, close it up, and head to the washing machine. All right, guys, we made it to the wash. Let's go ahead and put this lady one inside our washing machine. Next, grab our Rishubinator sneaker laundry detergent, squeeze and pour one full ounce. Let's close this bad boy up. As always, guys, when you're using the washing machine, use cold water with the regular cycle. We are back YouTube, we got the shoe at the washing machine. Overall, this shoe cleaned up nicely. The suede still looks a little rough, but that's a problem we'll solve later on in this video. For now, we got the shoe fully disinfected and cleaned up and we're ready to move on to the next step, thanks to our three brush advancing alarm system. What we're gonna do next is remove the yelling off the soles using Salon Care 40 and the sun. All done removing the yelling from the soles, as you can see, they're back to white. Now moving on with this restoration, we gotta do some prep work on the uppers. Right here in the toe box, we got some pretty deep scratches. Using some 600 grit sandpaper, we're gonna sand it down. All 
all done prepping the leather, as you can see, we had it nice and smooth and ready for the repaint. But before we do that, we're gonna use a brass bristle brush to reset the nap on the suede. Good to go with that. We got the suede nice and soft, buttery all around. It is faded, but we'll take care of that later. What we're gonna focus on now is completing the prep work on the leather by using acetone and cotton balls to wipe off the factory finish. Leather's good to go, now let's jump back to the suede. It's super buttery, but as you can see, it's super faded. So, using some Angelus Blue suede dye, we're gonna dye it using an angular brush. All done with the redye, you guys. As you can see, the suede is rich, vibrant all around. It's still buttery soft. I'm super happy with this turned out. It is a little dark, but I'm not complaining. Now moving on, we gotta tape off the soles, suede, and sock liner so we can lay down our paint. All taped up you guys, before we lay down our yellow paint, we gotta lay down a white base coat so the yellow can pop. White base coat laid down, now let's move on to laying down our yellow paint. For the yellow, we use opaque yellow with a little bit of red. All right guys, yellow paint's fully laid down. As you can see, all those nasty scratches that around the toe box and side panels are fully covered up. The last thing we gotta do is to go outside and spray it with some Carlisle matte finish. Woo! <laughs> yeah. All right guys, that's gonna wrap it up on this full restoration of these Air Jordan 1 Laney's. Honestly guys, I am so happy with how these turned out. The very first step I did was use our three brush advanced take and learn system and our detergent to get the shoe fully cleaned up inside and out. We got rid of all the grime and germs. Then we removed the yelling off the sole using Salon Care 40 in the sun and got them back to white. Then we moved on to the uppers. The toe box has some deep scratches and scuffs all around. Same thing with the side panels. We sanded it down before the paint job. Before we laid down the paint though, we moved on to the suede. The suede was super toasted on the shoe. We used our brass bristle brush to get it nice and soft. Then we completed this restoration by repainting the uppers. Again, you guys, I am super happy with how these turned out. You can find all the stuff you see right here at rejuvenator.com. Use my promo code in the description below. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is Vic Almighty. I'll see you guys next Monday.